The weekend has arrived and we've got baseball from Progressive Field in Cleveland. Tonight, it's the home opener for this new season between the Detroit Tigers and the Cleveland Indians. Two of the best bats in the business go at it next on the show. Standing in Kevin Kiermeyer. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. Leading off tonight for Detroit center fielder number 39. And a swing and a miss, so a first pitch strike as we're underway here this evening. Harold, we check out the Tribe as they begin here tonight. They'll look to make it three straight here as they come in on the heels of two straight wins. Yeah, Matt, you know, one thing I look at, they're protecting their own territory. I mean, they won the first two games of the series. They got a chance to sweep right now. You just can't let people come into your house and win games. One and two as the changeup had him out in front there. The one and two pitch. And he'll lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at two and two. And now a pitch on the way. And a good pitch there as this is swung on and missed for the first out of the ball game. In the second spot tonight. Short Into the windup and the pitch. Iglesias. Fought off at the plate as it's chopped foul. Bases are empty, one man out. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. This is just great pitching. They start him off with the slider to get the strike, and then they bust him in with a fastball. I don't know what he's thinking up there, but they really are messing with his mind right now. And they'll try to bounce a curveball on 0 2, but he holds back. It's 1 and 2 now. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Oh, he might have got away with one. Two strike breaking ball that ends up being in the zone. I think he probably won that out of the zone, but fortunately, he just fouled it off. To two balls no, and two strikes ball. now. Well, one thing about him, he's an absolute grinder at the plate. You can pretty much count on him battling at the plate every chance he gets. Not where he wanted that fastball to be, and it's three and two now. Danger looms on deck here in the person of Miguel Cabrera. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over toward foul ground. Under it is Alonzo. Two away now. The first baseman Miguel Cabrera stands in. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. And that swung on and missed for strike one. Well, he's just two outs into his major league debut on the mound. And so far, he doesn't seem nervous or like he's trying to do too much. That's easier said than done. And no swing, apparently. Ball one. Tries to that change up on him there, but it's a ball. Two and one. Two and one's the count. To two and two now. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. Slider whiffed on for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. Striding into the box, Jose Ramirez. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Jose Ramirez. Fastball too high to start him out here one and oh Harold these Tigers as they begin play here tonight they come in hoping to get back on the beam as they've dropped three straight yeah they're on a small losing streak but it could lead to a long one if you don't sit there and say all right it stops right here we got to put a stop to it right now somebody's got to come up with a big hit we got to get a good pitching performance we need to win the game because that's the mindset you have to have we're stopping it right now the buck stops here love the pitch call there 2-0 you know the guy's geared up for a fastball and you drop a changeup in the zone. That's going to be a tough pitch to handle. Throw just does beat him to the bag as that was pretty close. Patting second. So here's Francisco Lindor now. He certainly had it working for him at the plate this season. The average is up over 350 entering play. Here's the first pitch to him. 
fly ball out to straightaway right. Castellanos sprinting after it makes the play, and there are two gone now. Batting third. Stepping in, Edwin Encarnacion. He enters play, hitting down in the 240s for the year. Now a swing and a miss. Took something off that one, and it's strike one. He swung so hard, I don't know how he stayed on his feet or kept his helmet on. I'm surprised he didn't fall down. He swung so hard. What a big swing. No contact there from Encarnacion as the count runs to 0-2 on him. Well, there's no doubt what he was thinking on those first two swings, big power swings. Now he's got to dial it back a little bit and try to put that ball in play. Into the windup, here comes the 0-2 pitch. Down the third baseline. But this will be a foul ball, and it's still 0-2. Now another 0-2. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Yeah, that's the spot right there for an 0-2 pitch. Make him see if he'll chase that slider in the dirt, especially with the bases empty. Now here it comes. Ripped down the line. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at 1-2. and two. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 1-2. Swing and a miss for strike three. Pulled the string on him that time, and the inning is over. Digging in the switch hitter, Victor Martinez. Hitting, the Tigers, hitting right at the one for hitter, four pace with Victor a 250 Martinez. batting average for the season. And this is going to be a foul ball. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. And he just misses with a curveball. He still might be looking for that release point on that curveball early in this outing. That will look like it popped out of his hand behind his ear instead of out front. We'll see if he finds that pitch because it'll be important for him. And now a pitch on the way. And another foul ball. Matt, I like the last two pitches. A change up and then a fastball. And he's late with the swing on the fastball right there. You got him in between right now, and that's an advantage to the pitcher. That's a ball. And he lays off it to even the count two and two. Even at two balls and two strikes, here's the pitch. And he tries to get him to reach for it, but it stays outside three and two. Well, the one-two pitch didn't go his way, and now a miss there on two and two. You know he doesn't want this at bat to get away from him, so I think we're going to see a challenge pitch on a full count. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Chop fouled over towards the coaching box. He's just fouling him off till he gets something he wants to hit. The next 3 2. Now a swing, and he pops it foul behind the plate. And he'll indeed make the play in foul territory for the first out. So digging in now, Nick Castellanos. The season batting average comes in down in the 240s. Lays off 1-0. Looked like he was trying to work in a front door curveball there, but it seemed like it popped out of his hand a little early, causing it to miss inside. One and one. I think it's safe to say he wasn't ready for the fastball. Yeah, and they set him up with that curveball on the pitch before. And that one, they just blew right by him. And they could go either way Two now, balls, I suppose. Strike. And here's another one that misses to the Tiger right fielder as he moves ahead 2-1 and one now. And that's off his leg on the mound. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. Stepping into the box, Jimer Candelario. First shot for him Jimer here with a runner Candelario. at first now and one away. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Good swing, just got to try and straighten that one out. And that misses wow. one and one. No score here as we play inning number two. A 
A bullet to first base. And they will apply the tag between first and second. It's a double play, and just like that, the side is retired. Here's Michael Brantley. He'll get us going here in the bottom half of the second. Left fielder Michael Brantley. Into the windup and the pitch. And that misses ball one. One ball, no strikes. The one and no delivery. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. The one and two pitch. Again he sends it out of play. That's popped up out towards short right field. Machado ranging into the outfield and he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Batting pick. Ready now, first Yonder Alonso. Alonso. The Yonder average for him entering play, not far north of 200. And this one's nowhere close as that bounces to the plate for ball one. Now here's the pitch. And a strike to even the count. One and one. Well, the first two pitches are interesting. Both away from the left-hander. Will he bust him back in and challenge him? It's going to be a good at-bat to watch. Checks his swing here, but he does so in time. That's a great check swing. That's tough. Bottom of the second here with no score. Easy there, big fella. Two and two. Well, that changeup right there sets up a lot of things. Now the count's two and two. He can come back in with a fastball, and it's going to look like it's moving a little bit better. Or he can go back to that changeup. Hold high in the air out to right field. Moving under it, Castellanos. And that's the second out of the inning. And is the second baseman, Jason Kipnis. Second trying to make something happen with two Jason gone in the bottom of the second. Kipnis. And this one's not close. It's in the dirt for ball one. Now the pitch. Swing and a miss. Looked like the slider there. A ball and a strike. And signals crossed that time, so he'll step off and try again. From the windup, the 1-1 one -one pitch. But a big pass at a slider that gets past him. One and two, here it comes. Starts to go around, but the home plate umpire says he held up ball two. And he's getting his money's worth up there now. It's full three and two. Count is full. Here's the pitch. And this one's tapped foul at home plate. Once again, a three two. And awfully close there on three and two, but take your base, says Earl Hendricks. It's ball four. Batting seventh. Stepping in, Patrick. Jan Gomes. Jan He's ready for Gomes. his first at bat of this early season contest. And that misses for ball one. Seems like he's just lost the strike zone these last several pitches. He's got a walk, and that pitch right there, that wasn't even close. The 1 0 now to Gomes. That oh. missed. Close. It's ball two. With all that speed over there on first base, I'm not surprised to see that fastball on the outside corner. That's almost like a pitch out. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Kiermeyer's got a read on it. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side.
Now batting, Brian Pena. 7 8 9, bottom the of the order set to go here the in the catcher, third. Number 28, Brian Pena. Swung on and missed, outclassed by that fastball for a strike. The windup and the 0 1. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. The windup and the 0 2 pitch. Check swing, but he ball held ball up in straight. time. Ball one. Well, he's clearly in protect mode. 0 2. Good job of holding up right there. Oh, and they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Batting eight. Here's the Left first fielder, pitch to him. Leonis Martin. Leonis Here Martin. Up. Stands in as he swings and misses for strike one. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Geyer racing back at the track. And a leaping effort at the wall, but it's in vain. A home run. Counting ninth, second baseman, Dixon Machado. Hit the other way out toward right field. Geyer waits on it, two gone. Ready now for batting. another chance. Center Kevin Fielding. Kiermaier. Kevin 0 for 1 here Kiermaier. in the early going. First pitch hack in here, and that's the first strike. Here comes the 0 1. And this one's chopped foul right at home plate. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. And they'll try to tempt one, him with two. a curveball, but this bounces in front of the plate, and it's one and two. Oh, and they pull the string on a good changeup there as he swings and misses, and he's set down on. At the plate, Brandon Geyer. He'll get us going drive. in the home half of inning right number three. Brandon Here comes the first Geyer. pitch. And a curveball that started low and broke lower. Ball one. Now the pitch. And this one's too far inside. Ball two. From the windup, the 2 0 pitch. Outside, 3 and 0 now. Well, he finds himself in danger of walking the eight hitter right here. That's just something you don't want to do. You walk the eight hitter, the nine hitter can bunt him over, starts a big inning, right. and hit and run. It could lead to a lot of problems. Taking all the way that time. It's three and one. Into his motion. Here comes the three and one. A fastball right down the middle for a strike. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. Still hanging with him, another good swing to keep it going. Another payoff pitch. Here's a looping fly ball out to right. Castellanos moving to his left, looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. So one man gone for Cleveland here in the third and stepping in is the center fielder Rajay Davis into the windup and the pitch swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. That's a bad approach right there. Look you may get that pitch later in the at bat. If you're going to take a swing first pitch it's got to be a ball you can drive and that was not the pitch just got a piece to the right side. That winds up foul for the second strike. Looking to put him away. Here's the 0 2. And a fastball just a bit up. Well, it looks like he tried to waste one and get him to chase it. He didn't, but you're still sitting pretty. Now you're 1 and 2, and you showed him the high fastball. On the ground up the middle. And there's the first hit of the game for Cleveland. Riding in once now again, batting. Jose Ramirez. Baseman, 0 for 1 Jose for him here in this one. Ramirez. Line drive to left. And that'll get down for a base hit. 
also striding in Francisco Lindor as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. He'll hold off on the slider to start the at bat. It's ball one. And here's a fastball in for strike one. 91 miles an hour that time. One and one, here it is. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. And this is fouled at the plate. Well, that's back-to-back -back breaking balls. He's able to foul that one off. Will they come back with a third? Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Edwin Encarnacion now. Two on, two out for him here in the third. Good lead off a second there. Now the pitch. Nope. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. This is the guy they're going to have to be careful with. He can put three runs on the board in a hurry. So expect them to try to get him to chase something out of the zone if they can. That's wide. Two and oh. Three and oh now. After two breaking pitches, there's a pretty good chance right now you're probably going to get something right in the middle of the strike zone to swing at. So if you're looking for it, go ahead and turn that baby loose. Just got a piece up the line. Scooped up. On to first, and the Triber held in check as the inning is over. Here's the shortstop now, Jose Iglesias. He's 0 for, for 1 Tigers. thus far. Shortstop, Jose Iglesias. First offering on its way. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. In there, a base hit. He's around first, heading for two. But no, he puts on the brakes and will head back to first. Digging in for his second at bat, Miguel Cabrera comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. First pitch on its way. Line towards center field, and that's in there. Base hit. Here's the switch hitting Victor Martinez. Over one for him here in this Victor one. Victor Martinez. From the stretch, here's the pitch. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. One ball, no strikes. Getting a few steps off a second there. Now the pitch. And this one's in the dirt. Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. Down low, and the three plot balls, thickens no here. Three and O. Oh. He's really been good this game. Around the plate, throwing strikes, hasn't walked anybody. Right now, he finds himself a little bit of a hole, but he can battle back. Let it rip that time. Three O, oh, but the fastball's by him. Three and one. And this is fouled back and out of play. Looking to fade his first walk. Here it comes. In front of the change up there as this is chopped foul at home plate. The next 3-2. Now Martinez gets around on one as he sends it to deep right. And that's going to wind up hooking just a bit foul. So a missed opportunity there. set here's the three and two and a check swing here but the bat clearly breaks the plane as he set down for the first out 
Mike Nick Miller. Castellanos Nick now. Castellanos. Good lead there at second. Here's the pitch. Oh. In tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1-0. Swing and a flare hit toward right. Geyer moving to his left. Two down. The next batter, now Jamer batting. Candelario. Two men on, Jamer two away here in the fourth. Trying to hang a zero. Here's the pitch. And he swings through a fastball and doesn't catch up with it. It's 0-1. The 0 1 on its way. This ball will be chopped foul. Here it comes on nothing and two. Now a check swing, but he holds up in time. Ball one. Boy, he's barely still alive. That's a nice check swing right there. Two strikes, two outs, and he's still hanging in there. Now you take a deep breath and try to get something to hit. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. Decent lead at second. Here's the pitch. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. Here's Michael Brantley. He'll lead things Leading off here in this one run Indian. contest. Left fielder, number 23. Into the windup and the pitch. Takes a high fastball for a strike. Well, he got a high strike on a fastball right there. That's pretty unusual. Usually, early in the count, you're going to see a guy work down in the zone. That high fastball usually the put away pitch with two strikes. He pitched him backwards right here. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. And 1 and 1 as this one's in on the hands. And that's taken two up and in for ball two. Here comes the 2 1 to Brantley. A wave and a miss, a tick behind a good fastball. Now a ball lined toward the alley in left center. And Brantley will reach. He's got a base hit. Stepping in and ready for another First shot. Baseman, Yonder Alonso. He flew out Yonder in his last at-bat. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Yeah. A slider that he looks at over the outside corner. Tell you what, I'm already taking inventory in the fourth inning here, Matt. His secondary pitch has really been effective. He's used it well. He's getting a lot of good results from it. I just wonder if they're going to make an adjustment as the game continues. Over towards the dugout, but this one will get into the stands. Working for the punch out and the offering. That's lifted the other way out to left. Martin is under it. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. The second base so a runner at first with one man gone. Jason and standing in now the power hitting second baseman Jason Kipnis. First delivery to him on the way. Hit hard on the ground to second. And Kipnis is going to reach on a base hit. Digging in to try it again. Jan Gomes fly down in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. Just short, hit hard. And that's through into left, a base hit. Brantley rounds the corner and is headed home. And he is in there. At the plate, Brandon oh, Geyer. Right fielder, so far, six. 0 for 1 with a fly out. Swing and a ball hit out toward right center. On the move is Kiermeyer. He makes the play. Really had to hustle to get to that one. Two gone now. And he'll make it up to third on the fly ball as he's in there now with two away. Now 
Center Coming to the plate now, Rajay Davis, Davis. A base hit in his first trip. He's set and the pitch. And a neck high fastball that time. Looking to minimize the damage here. And this is going to be a foul ball. He's clearly looking to hit off the fastball and adjust. That's a pretty good swing after seeing two fastballs now in a row. Davis waits on the 1 1. Just a bit high that time as he misses for a ball. Hey, this is exactly what you do with the scrappy nine hitter. He's almost like another leadoff guy. He's battled himself right back into this at bat now with two outs. He's got a chance to get up, go ahead and drive in a couple runs. He's fallen behind now, three and one. He's set. Here's the three one. Skied into straightaway right. Castellanos moves over. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. In now, Brian Pena. He's 0 for 1 thus the far. The catcher, number 28, Brian Pena. Adam fooled there as this is lifted in the air out to left center and shallow. Brantley comes on and makes the catch in shallow left for route number one. How about him? Well, Trying to pick things Leonis up where we left off. Martin. Leonis Martin. He went deep in his first at bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. And that's into the gap and should be extra bases. Around first, he's digging for second. And he is in at second base with a one out double. Dixon Up Machado digs in. Second Comes into baseman. this at bat 0 for Dixon 1 in the ball game. Machado. Good lead off a second there. Now the pitch. And he throws the fastball by him here. 0 and 1. Oh and one count and the pitch chop foul at the plate here and it's 0 and two and the slider gets him swinging two gone standing in Kevin Kiermaier 0 for two with a couple of strikeouts for him so far ready to deliver here's the first pitch a fastball and he swings through it to fall behind oh and one here it comes and he chased up and out of the zone a swing and a miss the discipline has just been completely absent from this offense it seems like they're always finding themselves behind the count and, and a big reason why is they're swinging at all kinds of stuff that's not even in the strike zone and a check swing here. Did he go around? No, says third base umpire Clyde Washington. It's ball one. Trying to strike him out for the third time. In the dirt, and now let's see. And a nice job to keep the runners at bay as the count moves to two and two. Getting a few steps off a second there. Now the pitch. And that misses, so it's a full count, three and two. Good lead there at second. Here's the pitch. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. Digging in and looking for more, Jose Ramirez. He'll go to work trying to do Very something basement. about breaking this 1-1 one -one tie. Ramirez. They set the target in, and this finds the inside corner for strike one. Really feels like he's just on cruise control out there on the mound right now. Yeah, it really does, Matt, but this offense isn't helping him too much. It sort of feels like the next team to score is going to win this thing. And Cabrera will take this one for the first out. Digging in once again, Francisco Lindor. He's Francisco 0 for 2 thus far in this one. Lindor. Here comes the first pitch. Now a ball lifted high in the air towards shallow right center field. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Ready for another shot now. Edwin Encarnacion, 0 for 2 on his line thus far. And this one's nowhere well, close as that bounces to the plate for ball one. Well, 
And that pitch misses in the dirt, and it's 2 0 now. Pretty easy takes to start out this at bat. None of those pitches were even close to the strike zone. And a good comeback fastball there. It's two balls and a strike. Ready to deal. Here's the 2 1. Swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. Just a bit high that time as he misses for a ball. And you know what? Give this guy some credit up there because this had the look of being a very quick inning. He's been able to stretch this at bat out a little bit, and that's something that shouldn't go unnoticed. And awfully close there on three and two, but take your base, says Earl Hendricks. It's ball four. Michael Brantley. He's set. Here it comes. Michael Brantley is in for the third time as he looks at a ball high. It's one and oh. And this is going to find the crowd down the left field line. It's a ball and a strike. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. And a oh, neck-high fastball that time. A high fastball is in there. Well, that's a high fastball in the low 90s. That is a dangerous, dangerous pitch right there. He got away with one. The guy took the pitch. Maybe he's just measuring him up. I wouldn't come back with that again. And a slider bounces, and that gets away. And he'll make it into scoring position here with two away, as that'll be scored a wild pitch. Full count here it comes. This is skied into the air to straightaway center. Kiermaier's got a read on it, and that's the third out. Here's the shortstop. Now Jose Iglesias. Shortstop. Jose Iglesias. Here's the first pitch to him. Swung on and missed. Outclassed by that fastball for a strike. Swing and a miss, and he's quickly in the hole 0 and 2. You know, when a guy starts to get tired, you often see their breaking stuff start to flatten out, but that's not the case here. Still has really nice finish on that slider, as we just saw. So he ran the fastball by him for the punch out. Jose Iglesias goes down to become the first out in the sixth inning. Miguel Cabrera is in for the third time. Good cut that time by Cabrera, but he couldn't come up with it. It's 0-2. This is the time in the game you start thinking, hey, they might get better swings. Then you see a swing like that. Boy, he's still got it working. Trying to get Cabrera to chase there, but it's 1-2. and two. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. Hit slowly back to the mound. Throw on to first, two gone. Here's the switch hitting Victor Martinez. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that nearly broke our tie, but instead it's a foul ball. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. And a good idea to hold off strikes. on that swing. It's ball one. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. And he will strike him out. Ten now in the ball game. Here's Yonder Alonzo. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. First pitch coming. Here it is. And this one's not close. It's in the dirt for ball one. 
Well, he's having a good amount of success here, Dan, even though he hasn't really gotten a ton of swings and misses. Yeah, but for him, Matt, he's more of a pitch to contact kind of guy. And obviously, it's working so far. And the way he pitches, it really keeps his pitch count down. Oh, that's one he's going to want back right there. A fastball right in your wheelhouse, and you foul it off. Fastball. Whoa, look out. That just about got him in the coconut. Well, that'll wake everyone up. Anytime you buzz the tower like that, there's reason for people to start getting a little bit edgy. Wanted to go after the slider, but he holds off three and one. This is one of those rare hitters counts we've seen in this game. They're just having a difficult time getting it going. And he'll step off. Into his motion. Here comes the three and one. And that one misses. So the leadoff man will head down to first on ball four to start the bottom of the, the six. Second baseman, number 20. And is the second baseman, Jason Kipnis. It was a single for him in his last at bat. First delivery to him on the way. There's a fastball that just misses ball one. Takes a high fastball for a strike. He might want that pitch back up and away. That's a pitch you can really drive if you have the right approach towards that opposite field gap. Ready with the 1 1 pitch. And he gets a piece of this one to foul it toward the backstop. His timing looks good right there, Matt. That's falling up after a fastball. He still is able to get a piece of that breaking ball. 1 and 2, here it comes. Now a flare out to left center. And that'll get down for a base hit. Here's the catcher, Jan Gomes. A hit in two tries so far. Enrique Burgos will come on out. Now pitching for the Tigers. Number 67, and Francisco Mejia will Number get a chance to swing the bat here, Francisco and he'll do it in a good spot because he has runners at first and second and nobody out in the inning. Bullet back up the middle. Kiermeyer has to roam straight back, but he has it for the first out. The relay, and he's safe. Digging in once again, right Brandon Geyer. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. Ronnie Chisholm Hall will look to provide a little punch off the bench as he'll hit with runners at the corners and one out in the inning. And it looks like a right hander has gotten up to throw in the Tiger bullpen. And he lays off there, one and zero. Oh. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season.
runs outside, so it goes to 2-0 and now. I'm seeing him just a little too amped up out there right now. That's common with hard throwers like him. Running a blazing fastball up there is great, but if you can't harness it, what good does it do you? Well, obviously not biting on the first two, so they'll go ahead and give him the freebie here. Here's Rajay Davis now. He's one for two in the ball game. Bradley Zimmer will get the nod from his skipper to pinch hit, and he'll do so in a big spot. Base is loaded, only one away. And likely nothing up at third, but he'll step off and look him back anyway. And now a swing and a miss, and that's what you call establishing the inside part of the plate. It's strike one. He's ready for his first at-bat of this early season contest. A one pitch on its way. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. That one missed, but if it's a strike, I don't know how you get the barrel of that pitch. You have to really be sitting on it to hit a fastball coming in that hard on the inside part of the plate. And this ball runs away for ball two, two and one. Well, when the pressure starts to intensify, it often feels like the strike zone gets harder and harder to hit. This is a big spot here. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Three, one count, first and second. A lot of things can be happening here. I wonder if the runners start, but more importantly, get a pitch you can drive. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Martin is under it. He's got it, and there are two down now. And there will be no advance here. It's a wasted opportunity as the bases remain loaded with two away now. So a big moment here. And standing in, Jose Ramirez. Now pitching Alex for the Wilson answers Number the call 30. to pitch here in a big Alex spot. He inherits Wilson. a bases loaded jam, but needs just one out to get out of it. From the stretch. And a fastball to start things out here. Not close. It's a ball and no strikes. High in the air out to center field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Nick Castellanos now. He's singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Right fielder, number nine, Nick Castellanos. Swing and a miss, and he's behind 0-1. Well, he's thrown over 70% first pitch strikes to to all the hitters in the game right now. That's why he's pitching late in the game. He's getting ahead of guys, and then you can manipulate as you move forward. I think a big reason why he's been so effective in this one, that he's been just about getting ahead of every hitter. Seems like every one of them are 0-2, 1-2, and, and it's just about every at bat. And when that's the case, your chances of getting a good pitch to hit are way worse. So he gets the swinging strikeout on the changeup. Nick Castellanos is retired to start out the seven. Ooh, that was a good pitch to hit. He wants that one back. He was just a little bit late on it. And a fastball missed, just ball. a bit up. He's obviously been very impressive on the mound in this one. And I think the big reason why is his ability to stay out of the middle of the zone. That's kind of obvious, but it's clear to me that even when he misses his spots, he's not missing over the plate. He hit that changeup hard. Man, he saw it good. Just wasn't able to keep it fair. Uh, and he's just rolling right now and even dozen strikeouts for him now in the ball game. Catcher, Brian Pena. Brian Pena That's is ball. in with two away as he takes a ball one and oh. That one's going to find the seats strike one. Well he fouls off that fastball right there and you wonder does he love his fastball enough to come back with it three times in a row. Yeah. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. The one and two pitch. 
And he gets a piece here as this ball is fouled away. Ready on one and two. Good change up in the dirt. Strike three. And the throw to first ends the inning. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the traditional seventh inning stretch. So here's Francisco Lindor now. No Leading hits in three tries so far. He nice struck out stop. once. Francisco Lindor. First pitch of the at bat. Sends that one out of play for strike one. He's ready. Here's the 0 1. Man, a fastball just misses. It's 1 and 1. Here's the one and one delivery. A fastball and he swings through it to fall behind. He's going to need to shorten up and get that foot down a little bit earlier if he hopes to be catching up to that fastball. A ball and two strikes. Here it is. That's a ball. And mm, tough fastball to lay off on one and two but he did and it's two and two now. He's set. Here's the two two. And he'll stay alive here, but just barely as this ball's chopped foul at the plate, and the count holds it two and two. Never tempted to swing at that ball down low. It's ball three. Walks are never good, but they're especially bad news late in games like this. It seems like they always come back to bite you. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Martin able to take it in for the first out. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Edwin Encarnacion. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. First delivery to him on the way. And that misses inside 1 and 0. One run, six hits. No errors to this point for the Indians. And he swings on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. Now a swing and a miss and he's behind one and two. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one two. There's a swing and a missile sent out to center field. Back goes Kiermaier at the track. The wall. Oh, give me a break. That landed in Heritage Park. Ready for another shot now. Michael Brantley. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. Down and away, ball one. One out, nobody on. Now a drive out to left center field. Brantley will take the turn and head for second now. And he's in there safely. He's got a double. Here's Yonder Alonso. Over two of the walk for him so far. Yonder Alonso. Your attention, please. Now pitching for the Tigers, number 56. This change defensively for the Tigers. Good lead off a second there. Now the pitch. And he got him out in front that time. Strike one. Chisenhall. Now playing center field. Number four. Bradley Zimmer. Now catching. Swing and a miss. It's 0 and 2. Well, that's two strikes at the knees, and now you find yourself 0 2. I, I tell you, he's throwing the ball so well, you got to set your sights down low and look for any pitch down. Swing and a miss, and they'll dodge a major bullet that time. Two away. And is the second baseman, Jason Kipnis. Couple of singles to his credit thus far. And he'll take strike one on the fastball, registering at 93 that time. Looking to keep this a one run game, the pitch. One ball, one strike. Slider taken here, one ball, one strike. Here's the one and one pitch. Dribbled to the right side. Foul ball, strike two. Ball. 
Look out. That one almost got away from him. Two and two now. Pretty sure there wasn't any ill will behind that pitch considering he has two strikes on. Just got away from him from what I could tell. Swung on and he went fishing in the dirt. The throw to first is in time and the inning is over. Here's Leonis Martin. Already a home run and a double for Detroit. him in this one. Left fielder, Leonis Martin. Oh, started him with the change, and it's nothing in one. Man, I tell you what, I love how he's pitching right now. He has continued to pound that first pitch for strikes. When you do that, you set yourself up for great success. One and one. Now here it comes. One and two as the changeup had him out in front there. Time to be alert for signs of tiring here in the eighth. He's a pitch away from 100. Yeah, but he has been so good. You're talking about getting into the eighth inning with 100 pitches. Not many guys do that. Ball three. Three and two now. Hey, one of the things you want to do with a starter, get that pitch count up. Here's another productive at bat is this count now gets to three balls and two strikes. Struck him out and make it 14 punch outs now in the game. The Cody Allen Second gets the baseman. call as he'll pitch with Nixon. one gun in the top of the eighth. Your attention, please. Now pitching for the Indians, number 37, Cody Dixon. Dixon Machado is in with one away now as he swings and misses here at strike one. And then that's a pretty good example of why he's such a great pitcher. Yeah, one. stuff. Stuff is obviously the important key to being dominant on the mound. But it doesn't mean a whole lot if you don't have outstanding control to go along with it. But he does, and he really spotted that pitch. Swing and a little tapper. That goes foul, so he stays alive with two strikes. Again, a one-two. And here's a ball hit in the air. Under it is Alonzo, two away now. Standing now in Kevin batting. Kiermaier. Three at bats it. for him in this Kevin one. All ending with him Kiermaier. going down on strikes. And this is fouled straight back. The wind up and the 0 1. And a curveball that started low and broke lower. Ball one, one. one. From the wind up, the 1 1 pitch. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. That one is out of here. This game is tied. Ready for another chance? Jose Iglesias. He's working on a one for three thus far. And this will find the seats behind the first base dugout. Two out, nobody on. Comes back with a good change up there, and it's quickly 0-2. Started to go around there, but he holds up ball one. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. And here's a ball lifted back toward the stands in right, so we'll try it again at one and two. Ready to deliver the one and two. Hard liner, but picked up on a hop. And the throw to first is in time, but the damage has been done as the side. Riding in once again, Francisco Mejia. He'll start things out here in a tie. Francisco Mejia. Now action in the bullpen as their closer starts to get loose out there. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And that one stayed too low apparently. Here it comes 1 and 0. Oh. Back up the middle. Iglesias to his left. He's there. And the throw to first is in time. One gone. Digging in to try it again. Ronnie Chisenhall. His first plate appearance resulted in an intentional walk. Here's the first pitch to him. And he'll just get a piece here as this is chopped foul at home plate. 